just sitting here on my porch in the beautiful sunshine, drinking my coffee with all of you as usual. And today, gosh, I don't know. I have so many projects. I don't even know where to begin. I mean, I've got the two garden beds down by the street that I have to get stuff planted in. I have some other plants from the small stackable planter that I want to put in the little uh, cinder box garden bed thingy that I've made. Um, I'm thinking of planting potatoes today, but I don't know where. I've got my new solar setup I've got to get set up. I've got to finish that chicken coop and move it to its final resting spot and stake it down better and attach it together. Whew, the, the inside of the tiny house needs to be cleaned and rearranged. I've gotten, I've accumulated a lot of things and uh, I need to, I need to be careful about that because I don't want things to get too cluttered and whatnot. So I have to start getting the storage organized and whatnot. Um, I'll be able to get it done once my mom gets down here and brings that shelf and the little, and that little, um, somebody called it a tea table. I bet you that that's what it is. Um, and get that other stuff that I've got in there out of there, free up some more room. <sighs> I gotta fire up the new Guide Gear wood burning stove again, just to cure it a couple more times outside. And I don't know that I'll bring it inside until after I get the walls done. And also, don't worry, I'm going to tighten everything up with the proper tools. I need, a, I need a drill bit or an Allen wrench that fits inside the little screws so that I can get them real tight. Um, I'm also going to put up, I need to get a heat shield for the wall. I'm already going to bring, I'm going to clean up those uh, concrete block thingies and um, that's what the stove is going to sit on inside the tiny house and then put the uh, heat shield behind where the pipe goes up against the wall so that's all going to be done in the future of course I got to get my walls done I got to get the insulation done you notice how that's the last thing I have on my list to do because I hate it and I don't really know what I'm doing but I got to get it done so who knows what I'll get done today um, I think it's probably going to revolve around planting though because I love it. Yeah, I think it's going to be gardening for today.
here's what I did. I just transplanted all those herbs and that is peppermint, cilantro, oregano. I planted lemon balm in there, chives, more lemon balm, oregano, that looks like it's drying out a little bit, uh, not oregano, uh, cilantro, more peppermint, and then more lemon balm, chives, cilantro, peppermint, uh, dill. Oh yeah, that's right. I planted some, some dill up here too, but not the mammoth dill. The, um, I just had some dill seeds that I had saved from when I grew them in Ohio, so hopefully they'll sprout. And then I think that's oregano. So that's what I've done up here. And next, I'm going to do something with this. What do you think I'm going to do with that? I figured I'd go check those two big beds down by the street. I transplanted some green peppers down there so I could do the potato fin thingy. So let's have a look at them. I've planted one, two, three, four, five little green peppers and they're just real tiny. You know, they're just tiny right now. Hopefully they'll survive the transplant because they are at a delicate stage. I probably should have waited, but I really wanted to plant those potatoes so I don't know what else I'm going to put in this bed. I think that I am going to put beans in this bed. I'm going to take a whole row out of my bean thing because it's getting out of control. And plant some beans here. And maybe plant a, like one or two, um, you know, spreading viney type plants right here at the bottom so they can spread out this way. Um, maybe I'll plant some more tomatoes or some other sweet peppers here. But the rest of this, I'm not going to plant any more new seeds. Um, I am just going to transplant plants from here and there that uh, need to be thinned out. And so hopefully I'll get to this bed tomorrow and finish up that bed tomorrow too. Whew, it's been a lot of work, but it's going to pay off in the long run. Got a lot of work done today, but I still have a whole lot more left to do. I really, really need to get that new solar set up outside and functioning because my solar right now is basically shot. The batteries, the highest I get them charged to is 11.9, so they're damaged. I need to get that solar outside, so I'm just going to pray I have the energy to do it tomorrow. It shouldn't, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. It's just a new setup, new kind of wires, new everything. So although I kind of know what I'm doing with solar, I kind of this new thing. I, I'm hesitant. I'm hesitant to try new things. So I think that's going to be a goal for tomorrow among among so many other things. It's just going to be an ongoing process basically. So well anyhow that's all I got for you guys today. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.